Okay, folks, do you know what this creature is right here? It is some kind of artwork that is under a bridge called the Aurora Avenue Bridge or George Washington Memorial Bridge or something like that. And this thing is in Seattle, Washington. So the address for this thing called the Fremont Troll, which is in Seattle, like I said, it's at 36th Street and Troll Avenue. But look, it's the 36, you know, the 666. So I told you, if you add every number between 1 and 36 together, it equals 666. So this beast out of the sea, and, and you'll be... You'll understand why I'm showing you this in, in a little while. Just keep watching. This beast out of the sea, it's, notice it has only one eye showing. That's, you know, connecting to the Antichrist. And also, look at this. It's got a Volkswagen Beetle, which they also call a bug, under his left hand. And the, the Volkswagen Beetle was created in Germany. Okay, and why is this important besides the Hitler connection? But uh, Germany, I'm going to tell you why in a moment. Pay attention. Germany equals 8338-10634. Because Germany equals the exact same as the word Memphis, the place Memphis. 8338-10634. And why is this important? See, Elvis died in Memphis, which uh, which he was living, you know, he was living there since the age of 13, and he died at the age of 42. And I told you Washington's a 42nd state, and Elvis was known as the king, and Seattle's in King County. Anyway, so Memphis equals Germany, okay? And Elvis, he was stationed... In Germany, you see, when he went into the army. Again, connecting to Memphis, because Germany equals Memphis. And the Beetle was created in Germany, the Volkswagen Beetle. And who was the next sensation after Elvis? It was the Beatles. And the Beatles, the anagram is El Beast, because Elvis is the beast out of the sea. L means God, E-L beast, E-L for Elvis. And I know that beetle is not spelled B-E-A like the band, but look, beetles, a beetle in ancient mythology, you know, whatever, in ancient Egypt, Egyptian mythology, because, oh, I'm going to show you why I'm showing you this, but the, it, it, it has to do with the eternal, the eternal cycle of life, the symbol of rebirth, life, death, and res and resurrection. I told you, they're resurrecting Elvis. Okay. I forgot to mention that Memphis was one of the oldest and most important cities in ancient Egypt. Okay, that's another connection. What I'm showing you all this, because Memphis equals Germany, and that's where the beetle was created in Germany, right? And Elvis died in Memphis. Anyway, that's the whole idea of the the Volkswagen under the the hand of the beast here. But you know, and I told you that Elvis is the beast out of the sea, the water, right? And I told you that the name Elvis it equals the exact same as the word water, and it also equals the exact same as the word reset, because Elvis is the Great Reset. Anyway, 6722, 6832, it equals the exact same as Elvis. 6722, 6832. Elvis is the beast out of the water, out of the sea in Seattle. Anyway, this thing is called the Fremont Troll. <laughs> that artwork, sculpture, whatever the hell you want to call it. Look at all the number connections. Watch this. Elvis died on the 16th of August, 816. Look at that. And the 228th day of the year is August 16th. You see that? And look, you have a 666 across. You have the 222 because we're in the year 222. You see what I'm saying? 
I could show you many more things with the numbers here, but I'm going to skip it. So this Aurora Bridge where the troll is under, that Fremont troll, it opened on February 22nd. You see that? And that's Washington's uh, birthday, the day they celebrate it, you know, 222. And I told you it's been 222 years since Washington died. And this year's 222. And here's the real reason why I'm showing you this, besides the fact that it's in Seattle and it's a beast, you know, out of the sea type of creature. See this Volkswagen right here? Uh, you know, I've shown you all the connections already. But what was inside this Volkswagen? What did they put the sculptor, the artist? So if you go somewhere, it says the history of the Troll Monument. You know, the Fremont thing. Uh, the artist, the sculptor was a guy named Steve Bad Anus. <laughs> Bad Anus. <laughs> anyway, and, he, and it says... He won the competition. I don't know what the heck this is. Billy Goat's Gruff. Listen, look how ridiculous this is. It's got the bill like Bill Gates and the goat. Because Elvis is the goat. I told you that. Watch this. And it was 18 feet tall. Elvis was born on 1-8. Okay. And look what these guys did. Look at this. They put a time capsule inside the beetle and it was full of Elvis memorabilia. Look at that. See right here, it says originally the car held a time capsule including a plaster bust of Elvis Presley which was stolen from the sculpture when it was vandalized. So, so you see that? Elvis... You know, he's he's missing. He's not in his tomb. You get it? You know, whatever, man. I'm just saying this is ridiculous. I mean, out of all the things that could be with this, you know, this beast out of the sea, it was Elvis. Come on. And look, there's the cross streets. You see, third six 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 troll. Oh man. And let me tell you something, folks. I could have made this video another 20 minutes long with all the Gematria connections, but I'm just going to end it with this. Get out of Seattle. Okay, I told you it's going to be struck around June 11th. I don't know what, it's, what exactly is going to happen, but something spectacular is going to happen. End of video.